So today we're at my in-laws house and because I'm getting married. Hectic, but exactly what I expected. Um, I pretty much assumed that it would be chaos and every second of it has. And I, it's exactly what I prepared for. <laughs> Congratulations, Josh and Marcel. We are so happy for both y'all and hope your day is everything you dreamed of it would be. We love you so much. Congratulations, guys. We love you so much, and I cannot wait to see you with the future us. I'm so happy for y'all. Cannot wait to celebrate. Let's get hammered, black out, go crazy. Woo! Hey, you guys. I just wanted to say how happy I am for y'all and how exciting this whole process has been and how perfect I think you two are together. And I just wish for y'all a happily ever after. Happy wedding day, Josh and Marcel. I hope today is everything y'all hoped it would be, and I love y'all so much. Neither of us were looking for a relationship. We kind of just ran into each other. We like to call it right place, right time. Um, we met not ready to pursue anything, and then literally started dating since that second. Both Josh and I, it was like the more that we learned about each other, the more that we liked each other. So we never really had like that fizzling out phase. It just kept going, and then we were like, okay, we're in love. <laughs> Our first real date, he asked me out, we went to a restaurant and Josh showed up at the wrong one. Um, he blames it on me because I'm not specific, but I thought that downtown was a vibe, so I said agave and he was like, okay. Then he texted me looking for me and I was at a different agave. I still can't believe that today is real life. Um, we've been talking about this day since we were kids. Uh, it's been a beautiful day. Um, it's going to be a beautiful night. I wish the two of y'all uh, a lifetime of happiness and a lot of kids. Hey, you guys. I'm so excited y'all are getting married. And that's it, because this is too much and awkward. I love y'all. Congrats, Marcy and Josh. We're so happy for y'all. Um, I'm so excited that today's finally here and y'all get to have y'all's big day. And I can't wait to see what the future holds for y'all and for us to raise kids together. <coughs> the joys. Both of our personalities complement each other and he has everything that I lack, which I love. Um, we kind of balance each other out. He's very routine, he's regimen, like everything he does is very specific and it's planned out and it's got to go that way because he prepared for it and I'm like, oh, we're just doing whatever and we're going to have fun with it. So I feel like that really complements us and I think it's going to set us up for a great future. He is good looking. <laughs> so good looking. <laughs> Yes, and a funny story, I love his flow, and he said he's going to cut it off after the wedding. I love y'all both. We're so excited to celebrate you guys tonight, and can't wait for y'all's honeymoon. I'm so glad we finally got here. It feels like we've been planning for 10 years, but I wouldn't have had it any other way. I wish you both the best of luck. Um, I know you're going to have a fabulous life together and have many, many children to make me very happy to spoil. I love you guys. Happy wedding day. Josh and Marcel, I'm so excited that the day is finally here. We are going to get all the pompous out of the house, bring the dogs back home, and y'all are going to the DR. Can't wait to celebrate with you tonight. Love you both. Hey guys, this is it. This is your big day. We're so excited for you and we can't wait to celebrate with you tonight. We love you both and we can't wait to see what this life has in store for you. We are at the Airbnb that me and my groomsmen are staying at. Uh, just hanging out, playing a little football, watching a little football, and catching up. I woke up at about 4.30. I was a little nervous this morning. Um, not that I'm nervous about getting married and who I'm getting married to, but I'm just nervous about making sure this wedding is a perfect day. I look forward to celebrating y'all tonight. Wish y'all nothing but happiness. Um, I think that Marcel is going to be the drunkest tonight. Cheers to both of y'all. Josh, Marcel, thank y'all for letting me be a part of y'all's day. Love y'all, wish y'all nothing but happiness. Can't wait to celebrate. I'm honored to be a part of y'all's special day, and I just pray that God blesses y'all's relationship, that I can be with you all. Chloe and I can be there for y'all as friends through y'all's marriage. Yeah, uh, we met through a mutual friend. Um, it was one of those right place, right time situations. I wasn't supposed to be at his house that night. She wasn't supposed to be there either, and somehow our, our paths crossed. 
we never stopped talking after we first met and from there we just kind of had that instant connection. Our first date um, was a couple days after our first official date. We met uh, for margaritas and uh, at a Mexican place and I went to the wrong one. Uh, so I was pretty nervous beforehand, just worried about all the details. I called my sister to ask, hey, is this a good outfit? What should I wear? And I didn't get the details of the location, so I went to the wrong place. So I showed up a little bit late, um, but I guess it all worked out in the end. A happy wedding day and a year and life full of happiness and love. Hope that y'all accomplished everything I've ever dreamed for, and I will leave it with one quote from my dad. Josh, just remember, happy wife, happy life. But also remember my dad told me that when I was drunk, so. Hey man, uh, been knowing you for a long time. I've seen you at your best, and I've seen you at your worst. And today's definitely your best. Wish y'all most happiness and everything y'all ever want. Josh and Marcel, congrats to the both of you. You two are great for each other. I know y'all are gonna live a long, happy, healthy life. First off, she's beautiful. Uh, she's so caring and kind. Um, there's nothing in this world she can't do. Um, she struggles every day with arthritis pain. She's able to go to work, go to school, take care of the dog, cook, clean. She's just all around the most amazing woman. She's gonna be the most amazing wife, an amazing mother. Amazing to know that I'll have somebody like her throughout every stage of my life. Josh and Marcel, I just wanna wish y'all a long and happy marriage and at least one year, no kids. This is your big day. Um, I am proud of both of you. I know you guys are best friends and you guys are going to be very successful in your marriage. I'm looking forward to grandkids very soon. Love to both of you. Thank you so much for uh, bestowing the honor on me of marrying the two of you. Um, one of the highest honors of my life. Love y'all. Let's get y'all married tonight. Marcel Gumbo, y'all are a model of a strong relationship. Um, I, I wish y'all a long, happy, healthy life together. Um, remember to put God first in everything you do, and remember y'all have each other to lean on for every challenge you face. Very happy for the both of you. Congratulations. I hope the marriage is a success. It was Vegas and my birthday and I was ready to party. Um, so, unbeknownst to anybody besides me and my mom, I had purchased the ring and I had set up to go to um, the New York uh, Hotel in Vegas. That's where we had our first real big trip when we were dating only three months. And we were walking around the casino and I was like, oh, this is so cool, like, where are we? We walked out, I was like, wait, this looks like the Brooklyn Bridge. And then I realized we were in New York, Las Vegas. Yeah, you remember the last time we were here and kind of went down memory lane and then I'm gonna be honest with you, uh, I kind of blacked out at that point. He swears that he had this huge speech planned out, but he didn't say any of it. He literally was like, the last time that I was here, I just, and then I felt like I blinked and he was down on his knee and I was like, oh my gosh, we're getting engaged on my birthday in Vegas. Um, afterwards, I was like, here was my plan. Is that what I said? And she said, nope, those are not the words that you said, but we'll stick with your story, so. Yeah, I think I kind of blacked out a little bit, but I swear, I think I looked around like, wait, me? <laughs> and then I was like, oh my God. I can't wait to see you. Um, I know you're gonna be just drop dead gorgeous. I, I hope I can handle it, um, but I'm excited to see you. I'm excited to marry you, and I'm excited for the beginning of the rest of our lives. I am overwhelmed with emotion for this day and everything that it means for us. I can't believe that I found a man who checks every single box that I've ever had, and I just can't wait for the future. I'm very excited. I feel confident with where we're gonna go in life, and just can't wait for the celebrations, the kids, the family, like the house, all the exciting adult things. And I love you. <laughs>
I, Josh, take you, Marcel. I, Josh, take you, Marcel. To be my lawfully wedded wife. To be my lawfully wedded wife. My constant friend, my faithful partner. My constant friend, my faithful partner. And my love from this day forward. And my love from this day forward. In the presence of God, our family and friends. In the presence of God, our family and friends. I offer you my solemn vow. I offer you my solemn vow. To be your faithful partner in sickness and in health. To be your faithful partner in sickness and in health. In joy and in sorrow. In joy and in sorrow. And in life as well as in death. And in life as well as in death. I promise to love you unconditionally. I promise to love you unconditionally. To honor and respect you. To honor and respect you. To laugh with you and cry with you. To laugh with you and cry with you. And to cherish you both in this life and the next. And to cherish you both in this life and the next. That was Marcel. I don't think so. <laughs> I, Marcel, take you, Josh. I, Marcel, take you, Josh. To be my lawfully wedded husband. To be my lawfully wedded husband. <laughs> My constant friend and my faithful partner. My constant friend and my faithful partner. And my love from this day forward. And my love from this day forward. In the presence of God, our family and friends. In the presence of God, our family and friends. I offer you my solemn vow. I offer you my solemn vow. To be your faithful partner in sickness and in health. To be your faithful partner in sickness and in health. In joy and in sorrow. In joy and in sorrow. And in life as well as death. And in life as well as death. I promise to love you unconditionally. I promise to love you unconditionally. To honor and respect you. To honor and respect you. <laughs> to laugh with you and cry with you. To laugh with you and cry with you. And to cherish you both in this life and the next. And cherish you both in this life and the next. By the power vested in me in the Universal Life Church in the state of Louisiana, I pronounce you, Josh and Marcel, Whoa. as husband and wife. Ah. Josh, you may now kiss your bride. Yeah. Joseph Chibo, the second. <laughs>